Hello everyone. Today we're going to be making a video on the Code Talker anime cards that aren't in IRL or in Master Duel yet. So if you guys enjoy this, please make sure you guys leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Let's see it. So looking at the decks, Knights of Ahonoi. All right, Bitron, Digitron. We already know those were there. Balancer Lord, Bit Trooper. Was this an anime card? I'm not sure. Yeah, I think that's an anime card because I've never seen that card before. You can send one level two or lower monster from your hand to the graveyard special summon this card from your hand. You can only use this effective Bit Trooper once per turn. I don't know if that's in the um, Boot Stagger Capacitor Stalker. Is this an anime card too? Yeah, it looks like this is only in the anime as well. Capacitor Stalker. Dude, imagine if we had this in Yu Gi Oh! Master Duel. When this card is normal summoned, you can target one other Cybers monster you control. While this face up monster is on the field, that monster gains 800 attack. If this card is in the monster zone, it is destroyed by card effect, and since the graveyard, each player takes 800 damage. You only use this effect of once per turn. Hmm. Not the best card, honestly. We could do without that one. Cluster Congester. Do we have that one in, in there? Um. Some of these cards just might be in the game. I'm not sure. Deflect compiler. Yeah, that's in the that's in um, real life for sure. Wait, where did I go? Okay. Okay, we got lockout gardener, link infra flyer, latency interrupt, flick clown. I think those are actually in the game. Lockout Gardener in the game. Protection Wizard. I'm not sure if this is in the game. Link Monsters links to this card cannot be destroyed by battle. If your Cyber's Link Monster would be destroyed by battle, you can banish this card from the graveyard instead. <laughs> That's broken. Are we going to have to really all go all the way back? All right, so I found some cards. What well, we went all the way to the bottom. Shoot, Draco. Now I'm not sure if that's a card. Scandal. I don't know what this is. I don't think I've ever seen this card. When this card is normal summon, you can pay 1,000 life points and target one trap your in your opponent's graveyard. Activate on your opponent's field. You can tribute this card, then target one monster you control. It can make a second attack during the battle phase this turn. Mm, I guess. Uh. Dotscaper duel. Vault Toll Answer. I've never seen this thing, honestly. These are just cards I haven't seen yet. If this card is normal summon, you can target one attack position monster on the field, change it to the defensive position while this card is in defense position. Your attack monster position monsters cannot be destroyed by card effects. Pretty good. Spool code, we already seen that. Security block spam mail. What's this one? I don't think this is in the in the game. Equipped only to an effect monster you control. If it has its effects negated, also it is treated as a normal monster. If this card is sent from the hand deck or filled to the graveyard by a card effect, you can draw one card. And if you do, show it. Then if your opponent controls a face-up card, that type of card, monster, spell, or trap, return one of them to their hand. That's kind of broken. Spam mail. Zero extra link. He wrecks people. This is in the anime. I mean, this is in um, Yu Gi Oh! Master Duel. It's pretty good for KOing your opponent with all your leak monsters and stuff. Doppler phase coding? What is this? This is crazy. Doppler phase coding. Target one Cyberus monster you control, equip this card to it. The first time the equipped monster would be destroyed by battle each turn, it is not destroyed. This card is sent from the field to the graveyard during the battle phase. In the battle phase. So is this like a normal trap? 
see, I see. We got a limit code. You guys know what it does. Nothing too crazy. Link restart. I don't think we have this one. Oh, yeah, we do. We have this card. When a spell or a trap card or monster effect is activated, that will inflict damage and negate the activation. If you can't banish this card from your graveyard, target one link monster in your graveyard. Special summon it. Not the best card. Link surge counter. I don't think this is in there. When your link monster battles an opponent's link monster with higher link rating, during the damage calculation, banish two spells slash traps from the field or in the graveyard. Your monster's attack becomes equal to the attack of your opponent's monsters battling during the damage calculation only. That's pretty good. Parallel port armor. I think this is in the game. We don't really need to look at that. Recoder live, of course. Pretty good card to keep you in the game. Shield Handler. When this card effect is activated, that would be destroyed by monster. Target one link monster on the field and negate the effects of your opponent's targeted monster. If you do equip this card to target monster, monster cannot be destroyed by card effects. I think that's in the game too. Link processing failure. Did I miss this one? Destroy this card during your second standby phase after activation. Activation. Activate this card by targeting one link monster you control. While this card is face up on the field, monsters that are link monsters and link monsters with link rating lower than the equal to that targets cannot attack. When the monster leaves the field, destroy this card. Not the best. Did I skip a bunch? Draco now. I don't know if this is in the game. When this card is normal summon, you can special summon one level two or lower normal monster from your hand and defense position. <laughs> Rescue interlacer. Oh, this isn't the game. Never mind. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Salad of a jet driver. Oh, yeah, that's in the game. Okay, uh, are we missing any striping partner? Oh, yeah, Panther. Alert Lancer. Arrow Charge. Battle Buffer. Okay. This turn, if Cyber's monster attacks a defense position monster, inflict piercing battle damage to your opponent. That's pretty good. Against the Castira sweaty card. If there are, what is this one? Arrow charge. If there are two link monsters with the same link rating in the extra monster zones, draw two cards, and if you do, show them, but banish them during the end phase of this, of this turn if they are still in your hand. Battle buffer. See, this looks broken. Activate this card by targeting monsters your opponent controls up to the number of co-link monsters you control. Those monsters cannot activate their effects while you control co-link monsters. Also destroy this card during the end phase of this turn. This card is ridiculous. After damage calculation, if the Cyber's link monster battle place one battle buffer counter on this card, attack the attack of all Cyber's Link monsters you control become the original attack of the number of battle buffer counters times 700. Dude, that card's freaking broken. Where'd the deck go? Okay. Okay. Cybersal Cyclone? Do we have this one? Yeah, we... we we don't really care about that. Cybers Annihilation. What is this? I don't think I've ever seen this card. Equip only to a Cybers monster. If the equipped monster battles an opponent's monster, the equipped 
monster's attack becomes equal to the attack of the monster it is battling during the damage calculation only. If the equipped monster destroys a monster by battle, inflict damage to the controller equal to the attack destroyed had on the field. That's pretty good. Catch your opponent off guard. Cyburst Cash. This card looks sick. We need so we these cards need to come in the anime. What's going on? I mean, come in real life and and master duel. If you control a cyburst monster whose current attack is different from its original attack, draw two cards. That's pretty OP. <laughs> you still got to set up though, you know. I don't know. Will they? Will they? Uh. All right, we got another three strikes barrier. What is this card? If your opponent controls exactly three cards, activate one of these effects. This turn, your monsters cannot be destroyed by battle. This this turn, you take no battle damage. This turn, each time your, your monster inflicts battle damage to your opponent, gain the same amount of life points. That first effect's really good. Transaction rollback. Pay half your life points, then target one normal trap in your opponent's graveyard. This card's effect becomes a normal trap's effect. You can pay half your life points and banish this card from your graveyard. Then target one normal spell or trap in your graveyard. This effect becomes normal trap's activated effect. It's copying Mirror Force <laughs> in the anime. Oh, okay. Cynet D. I, I, I went too far down. <laughs> Sorry about that. Cynet Defrag. What is this? Activate this card by targeting one level 4 or lower Cyberus monster in your graveyard. Special summon it in defense position. If you do, equip this card to it. When this card leaves the field, destroy that monster. Once per duel, if this card is in your graveyard, activ activate the above effect by paying half your life points. So you can activate it twice. That's Dude, they need to bring this. Basically, Monster Reborn for defense, though. Sign at Backdoor, pretty good card for the anime. Sign at Universe, Disconnect Linker, what's this one? This one looks fuck freaking sick, this card. Dude, this card looks broken. Target one, Link 2, or lower Link Monster in your graveyard. Special Summon it, but it has its effects negated, if any. And if you do, immediately after the effect resolves, Link Summon using the monster as a material. If you cannot Link Summon, banish that monster. The Link Summon Link material is unaffected by your opponent's card effects. Also, monsters in the extra monster zone cannot attack while it's face up on the field. That's pretty good. Effect Cal. If you control Cyber's monster, you take no effect damage this turn. Oh, if you control a Cyber's monster. Frontline Disturbance. What's this? Target one level four or lower monster your opponent controls. If it leaves the field, put one Disturbance counter. Uh, I think that's, that's part of the um, game, too. I'm not sure. All right, that's pretty much all the spell cards. Do we miss any of these? I don't think we missed any of these. Lockout Gardener. Yep. We got all the, the spells. Urgent Link. When your opponent monster declares an attack while you control no monsters in the extra monster zone, half any battle damage you take in the battle at the end of the battle's turn, you can link summon one cyber slink monster. That's pretty good. Urgent link. Okay, we got binary blader. I don't oh I think that that's in the game. This 
This card gains the effects based on cooling monsters. Once per turn, this card declares an attack and punish you. Yeah. You know what I'm huh? Pretty good. Binary Sorceress. I have this card in real life, so I'm pretty sure it's real. Real. Oh, you can buff your attacks. I don't even know what that card did. Uh, what else do we got? Deco Talker. You gotta go to Deco Talker. The OG negate effects. Tribute one monster, negate the activation. Let's go. End code talker. Try to hurry up with this. Firewall Dragon Link. What is Link Devotee? Yeah, I think this card's like banned, is it? Link Devotee? Should I use this one? One level four lower cyber monster. If this card is special summon for the rest of the turn, you cannot link summon link three or higher link monsters. If this card is co-link, card is tributed, you can special summon two link tokens. <coughs> I think that card's banned. I'm not sure. You Link Bumper. Once per turn at the end of the damage step, if you're a monster, this card points to attacks uh, opponent's Link Monster. You can activate this effect. The monster attack gains one additional one additional attack on the Link Monsters during the battle phase. For each Link Monster you currently control, except this card. No, uh, it's got to app. Trash. Link Disciple. Link Spider. Multi sledgehammer. What the heck is this? After damage calculation, if another cyber link monster you control is attacked, place one hammer counter. If if this card is co-linked to a cyber monster, attack directly. Blah blah blah. Okay. All right. Is this almost done? Security dragon. Restoration point. Oops. I need to plug my phone in. It's dying. Link Spider, Power Code Talker, Recovery Sorcerer. What's this? I don't think I. I don't think this is a real card. Once while face up on the field, if this Cyber's Link Monster code link to the same type is destroyed or since the graveyard quick effect, you can target one of those Link Monsters, special summon it, but have its effects negated. Also destroy it during the end phase. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, what else do we got? I honestly don't know if these are all the cards, but these are the ones that... Restoration, Point Guard, Secure Gardener, Security Dragon, whatever the heck... What does this thing do? Two Cyber Monster. Once while face up on the field, if this card is co-linked, you can target one monster your opponent controls, return it to their hand. You can only use the effect of Security Dragon. Oh, it's like a little mini Firewall Dragon. Space Insulter. I think that's in the game. Vector Scare Arc Fiend. Yeah, this definitely when this definitely in in in, in the um game. <laughs> When this card destroys an opponent's monster by battle, you can tribute one monster this card points to and special summon that destroyed monster to your opponent's zone. This card points to, and if you do, this card can make a second attack on that monster during the battle phase. Now, I don't know why that card don't exist yet. Oh, I don't think we looked at this one. If this card is in your hand, you can target one level three or higher monster you control. Reduce its level by two. If you do, special summon this card. Not bad, not bad. <coughs> Grid Sweeper. 
Rom Cloud or Sim Tablet Threshold. Trash Hacker. When this card is declared involving a Cyrus monster, you, you, you can banish this card from your graveyard and negate the monster's effect. Also, for the rest of the turn, your opponent's monster cannot be destroyed by battle. Any battle damage your opponent takes is double. That's OP. If you control no monsters, you can special summon this card from your hand by discarding one Cyberus monster. Storm Cypher. Cannot attack direct directly. Or attack monsters in the extra monster zone. Unaffected by monster effects activated in the extra monster zone. Cannot be destroyed by battle with monsters in the extra monster zone. That's kind of trash. Poisoning blocker. Once per turn, you can change this card to defense position. If you do, the card gains 800 attack. Defcon Bird. You can discard one other Cyberus monster. You special summon this card from your hand. You can only use the effect of Defcon Bird once per turn. Once per turn, when a Cyberus monster is targeted for an attack, you can make its attack come double the original attack. Change to that's OP. Oh, Cybers Magician, Cybers Annihilation. We've seen that one. Where'd it go? Dang, it keeps going back. He had hell he had heck of, um I think this card's banned. <coughs> <coughs> One link to a higher monster link summon you can up the link rating material link monster you cannot be using material so OP. EX Slayer? What is this? While this card points to a monster, your opponent monsters cannot target this card for attacks once per turn during the damage calculation. If this card is... If this card or Cyber's monster, this card points to battles in effect. You take no battle damage. If a monster XC summoned to a zone, this card points to you contribute one monster in special summon one. Oh, that's pretty good. Access Code Talker. OP Firewall Exceed Dragon Cyber's Quantum Dragon Drastic Draw. This was in the anime. This is coming out pretty soon in IRL. Banish all monster you control, draw three cards, you can activate the draw to draw once per turn. Sign at ritual. Oh yeah, we've seen that before. Sign at optimization. Sign at fusion. Sign at closure. This card looks sick. Sign at closure. During your main phase, banish one card from your deck face down, and if you do, return that card to the graveyard. When the cyber's link monster destroys an opponent's link monster by battle, you can activate one sign at closure once per turn. Um, Overfloater, never seen this. What? This card looks broken. After damage calculations, this card is destroyed by battle with an opponent's monster. You can target that monster, negate its effects. It can. You cannot use the following effect, Overfloater. The turn you apply this effect over floater. When the opponent monster declares an attack while your opponent controls more monsters than you do, you can banish this card from your graveyard and target one attacking monster and negate the effects of all monsters your opponent controls with original attack less than or equal to the original target monster's original attack. Damn, that's a confusing ass card. Metal Morphosis. 
This card is normal or special summon. You can declare one monster type and one attribute. All normal monsters you currently control become that type and attribute until the end of the turn. You can release this effect of Metal Morphosis once per turn. Link Slayer, L2, Catch a Veiler. Cyber's Effect. If this card is normal or special summon, you can target one Link. Two monster in your graveyard, special summit, but negates effects pretty good. Average <laughs> format skipper, dot skipper, degrade buster, clock wyvern. Yeah, we know about all those. Oh, yeah, code hack. Code talker monsters you control cannot be destroyed by card effects. Once per turn during the damage battle step, if your code talker monster battles an opponent's monster, you can change. The opponent's monster attack to zero until the end of the battle phase. Also, monsters cannot be destroyed by that battle. Neither player takes any battle damage from battle during the damage step. When your opponent activates a spell or trap card while this card is in the graveyard and your Code Talker monster is battling, you can banish this card from your graveyard and negate the activation. If you do, Code Talker monster is gain 700 attack. That card's broken. Fusion Monster, Borload, Furious Dragon, oh yeah. It just keeps going, huh? Um, my, my phone is like on its last fluid. Trying to find link pressure. During damage calculation, if your link monster battles an opponent's monster, send one Cyber's monster from the extra deck to the graveyard. Your monster gains attack equal to the link rating times 1000 during that damage calculation only. Also, your opponent monsters cannot be destroyed by that battle, and your opponent takes no battle damage from that battle. Wait, what? That's kind of stupid <laughs> okay we're missing try wizard update jammer what's update jammer oh yeah he uses that if your link monster attacks a defense position monster inflict piercing damage to your opponent Link Karibo, L phase. Two level two or higher Cyber's monster gains three attack for each of these monster coins. Two, if this card links them into the field, you can target. This is something that's pretty good. Detonate Deleter. Oh yeah, he's in the game. Double Bite Dragon. Gains the attack of Link, monster, blah, blah, blah. Unaffected by monster effects, except Link, monster. See, that's broken. We still have so many to look at. Alright, we'll try to get through it quick. Cyber's Bridge. Send one Cyber's monster from your hand to the graveyard. Target one monster you control in the extra monster zone. Move it to the main monster zone. Then draw one card. If that monster you you can't, if it is a monster you can special summon one Cyber's monster from your graveyard at the same level as that monster. Otherwise, send it to the graveyard. Dang, that's pretty good. Keep you in the game. Cyber's Pride. <laughs> During damage calculation, if your Cyber's monster battles an opponent's monster, target that monster you control. Cannot be destroyed by battle this turn. Also, if the battle's an opponent's monster with higher attack, pay equal attack. And if you do, it gains attack equal to the life points you paid to the end phase. Sign that codex, sign that fusion, sign that money, sign that information. Decode destruction, dimension link. Activate this card by paying half your life points. Then target one Link monster you control. Banish it. If a Link monster summoned to you the field. If a Link monster is 
summons to the field, you can send this face-up card to the graveyard. Special summon that banished monster to the zone. A link monster points you. If you do, it gains 600 attack, but negate the effects and destroy it at the end of the phase. Grid wad, link back. That I use that card sometimes. I should. I don't know if I should run it. Link bound. I have that card. Link drive. Once per turn, you can tribute one link monster and inflict damage to your opponent's equal tribute link rating times 500. Link satellite. Activate this card by targeting one link monster you control. Place the satellite counters on the card equal to the monster's link rating. When that monster leaves the field, destroy this card. Neither player can declare an attack. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> it's OP. <laughs> okay. Arrow break. When your opponent activates a trap card, you while well, you control a monster, control a link monster, negate the activation. If you do, destroy that card. If you control a link three or higher monster, you can activate this card the turn it was set. And if you control a link four or higher monster, you can activate this card from your hand. That's broken. Break and rescue. Target one link monster you control. Destroy it with special summon one monster from your graveyard in attack position with the attack less than or equal to the attack monster destroyed, but it have its effects negated. Uh, I don't know. Care conversion. When your monster you control is targeted for attack, tribute that monster in the battle phase, draw one card, then if it is a monster life points equal to the attack. Draw discharge. When your opponent draws cards, except during the draw phase, look at those cards. If any of those are monsters, inflict damage to your opponent equal to their combined attack. And if you do, banish all the cards you looked at. <laughs> <laughs> That's not broken. <coughs> Excess lesser linker. When your link to or lower link monster battles during a damage calculation, your battling monster's attack becomes equal to the attack of the monster it's battling during that damage calculation only. Pretty good effects. Okay, how far was I down? Alright, I think that's it guys. Hopefully hopefully I got through basically everything. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out and later.